The Ethan Allen building, the old Ethan Allen building that stood right here on this corner behind me, wasn't that big. It was only two stories tall and about a half a block long. But when it came down, the debris cloud and the dust cloud fanned all across the square. And look at this video from a government building next door. A white van, then a black Ford drive away only seconds before that building starts to come down. Another camera angle shows cars turning at the intersection of North Water and Kansas, and then suddenly here comes the falling debris and dust. You can clearly see how close these people were to getting caught in the collapse. Amazingly and fortunately, no one was hurt. One more angle here showing the partial collapse of that historic building. A real close call. Now, several buildings on North Kansas or North Water and Kansas remain closed, and that's because inspectors are going in to check on the uh, structural integrity of these buildings. And, you know, because there's so many businesses and people that work in here, they're taking the safe route, making sure those buildings are safe before they let anybody go back in. And after seeing that surveillance video, it's real easy to see why they're taking the cautious approach. Mm -hmm. Reporting live tonight, Stacey Cameron, KNBC 9 News.